So I'm going to be talking about CAMP. <laughs> okay, so once the hormone binds to the receptor, then that activates G protein. From there, G protein activates adenylate cyclase, which converts ATP into CAMP. Okay, then we're going to talk about uh, the DAG IP3. It's the same thing. IP, the hormone binds to the receptor, which activates the G protein. From there, the G protein activates phospholipase C. Phospholipase C makes DAG and IP3. Now, IP3 causes the release of calcium, but together, DAG and IP3, they both work together and convert PLC into PKC. PKC is protein kinase C. PKC makes more calcium channels for calcium that has been released to enter the cell. So, calcium combines with calmodulin, which then activates the enzyme. It's in the cell. <laughs> Stop.